Linda is a really worthy recipient of the International Alumni Award at ECU for many reasons. She graduated here in 2005 and then went on to do a master's at Manhattan School of Music and following that really quickly became one of the most in-demand jazz bassists in the world really. What led me to studying at WAPA was seeing the amazing musicians who were coming out of WAPA and going to see shows around town from people who are affiliated with WAPA and studying there. And I started playing bassoon in the Wajo, West Australian Youth Jazz Orchestra Composers Ensemble. So I was able to sit in the woodwind section and turn around at some of the improvising jazz musicians who were on the raised platform behind me and I was just in awe every week and that really inspired me to take up the bass at WAPA and learn how to improvise. We're proud of her because she's really humble, she's humorous, she's an absolute joy to work with. Uh, WAPA has given me so many great tools uh, that have helped me get to where I am. I live in New York City at the moment and there are some who have moved to New York City and there are some that I um, I see you around the world when I'm travelling. I remember um, bumping into Dane Alderson, who also graduated from WAPA. Um, I think we were in Italy and he was playing with the Yellow Jackets. I, I see Troy Roberts and Desmond White um, in New York City um, pretty regularly and, and Nerissa Campbell. And it, it's a beautiful community to, to be a part of, uh, to be able to um, play music and, and have these memories at WAPA and still reconnect, um, even if we're not in the same city, you know, um, when we're meeting around the world. She comes back here and works with the students every few years and they absolutely love her. She inspires them and I think you couldn't ask for more as a WAPA graduate.